Hello everyone, this is Harsha. Welcome to my channel Crypto English. So hi guys, in today's video we'll talk about another exploit. So recently I made a video about Elrond exploit and now we will be talking about another exploit which has happened on Osmosis uh, zone. So everything will be covered in this video, how this exploit, actually there was a bug in the recent update, how the bug was turned into exploit and how people made or how people converted $200 into $2 million by using this bug. So everything will be covered in this video, watch this video till then. Before starting the video, if you are here for the first time, subscribe to the channel. If you like the video, click the like button. If you have any doubts or collaboration, leave them in the comment section below. And this video like that is 500 likes, so definitely click the like button right away. So let's begin the video, guys. So first thing, what has happened with the Osmosis? So before that, what is Osmosis? So if you are not aware of Osmosis, it's one of the blockchain on Cosmos ecosystem. And they also have AMM protocol built on this chain. And they have a total of 266 million total value locked in the protocol. So now what has happened is recently the problem started with this particular update. So if you see that Osmosis version 9 was announced and that was a nitrogen update and that came out on June 7th 4 p.m. UTC. So after this update people started like the, uh, the thing started getting worse. So on Reddit, one of the random user posted that uh, there is a bug in Osmosis new option and that is a serious bug and he mentioned that if you add $100 liquidity and if you remove that liquidity, by the time you remove, you will be getting 50% more tokens, which means you will be getting $150. So that was a bug and people were not believing and some people started uh, uh, trying it out and it started working. Then. Uh, immediately after some time this reddit post was deleted and within few hours later the entire cosmos uh, sorry osmosis chain was halted temporarily due to some technical issue and they didn't mention anything at that point of time but after that we got an official announcement from osmosis twitter handle they mentioned that there was an exploit or a bug in the recent update and there was a fund loss of over 5 million dollars so now what exactly has happened? So if you see that uh, the bug was actually working. So this is one of the exploiter wallet. So who has used this bug in turning $60 into maybe like $200,000. So now if you see his wallet, this is the fifth page, 15th page of the transaction. So if you see here, this is the first transaction which has started. So first transaction started with join pool, then exit pool, join pool, exit pool. So here is not, he's doing just adding liquidity and removing liquidity to the pools. And then on 14th, if you see same thing, join pool, exit pool, 13th also same. So it's go on till 15 pages. So now what exactly he was doing? So I'll show you the real time transaction. This is the last transaction where he has done the join pool. So let's open this into a new page. So he, this particular transaction was done on 7.23 p.m. And it was a join pool. So it was a like adding liquid to the liquidity pool. So the transaction was adding liquidity of 113,000 USDC so it is mentioned as unknown but it's a USDC token along with a $113,000 worth of Osmosis token. Then immediately after few minutes there is another transaction of exit pool so if you see the exit pool transaction this has happened like uh, roughly around 20 minutes after the first transaction. Here you can see when he is exiting the pool, pool he got almost 50% more tokens than what he has added. So in this way, people started draining the liquidity pools. They are just adding the liquidity. They are just removing the liquidity with 50% profit. So and they started moving those funds to a different blockchain on Cosmos. So now this entire cycle was happening and they were able to loot around uh, 5 million dollars. And as per uh, Osmosis, only four individuals were able to make around 90% of the total exploit. So which means maybe around 350 dollars worth of uh, three fifty thousand dollars worth, uh, sorry, three point, uh, maybe three point eight million dollars worth of funds were looted by only four individuals. So out of those four individuals, two individuals came out stating that they are ready to return the funds, and with the help of some blockchain transaction, they confirmed that I agree to send the exploited funds to the recovery fund address of Osmosis so and so wallet. So immediately after this post so only now two other were left out which were not identified at that point of time so this was posted at june 8 uh, 10 48 pm so immediately after 50 minutes there was a post from here you can see june 8 uh, 11 38 pm in a standard time there was a post from five stake uh, so if you're not aware of the five stake so this is one of the validator uh, it, they are running 10 uh, validators on 10 different chains on the Cosmos ecosystem and they are the validators of the 
Osmo, uh, Cosmos blockchain and they were validator for Osmos is also. So now they came up with the story that they, they team member, there are two team members from the uh, fire stake started testing to see the bug, whether it is actually working or not. And then they start, it started working and they started feeling greedy and they continued to do this and like they added, removed the liquidity and they were able to manage to convert 226 US dollars to around 2 million dollars and here they clearly mentioned that like uh, uh, we were thinking only about a family future and we were not thinking about the future of the community and so and so. So later they realized it and they came out to social media and they, uh, they agreed that they have done this mistake and they were ready to return the funds. So this is the entire story. So now after this fire stake has withdrawn from the validator, uh, they are no longer validator on uh, Cosmos ecosystem right now. So this was an incident. So completely almost 95% of the funds were recovered uh, from this exploit and remaining funds will be recovered from the uh, Osmos team itself. So now important question here is this was a very serious bug and this could be easily identified with a simple testing. So this was a basic thing when there is a liquidity addition and removal, the, the calculation is not wrong. They should be able to find out in the initial UAT testing itself. So as per my knowledge, as per this uh, rollout, I feel this Osmosis team has not done proper testing, not even a basic testing to check whether the code is right or not, because it is a basic thing when you're adding liquidity and removing liquidity, whether the numbers are correct, you need to check that. So at least this should be a basic test cases which should be available in their UAT testing, but I don't know how they skipped it or what has happened. We don't know, but this shows us the quality of testing or quality of like uh, uh, testing what they are following uh, that shows the negative thing of this particular product. But let's hope this project will come back and now they already recover the funds based on this. They will learn something new and they will implement some additional security level checks when they are rolling out any new versions. So now that's all guys. That is all about today's video about Osmosis exploit. If you like this video, click the like button. If you are new to this channel, subscribe to this channel. If you have any doubts or clarification, leave them in the comment section below. So that's all guys. Thanks for watching. Jai Hind.